Confusion and disappointment among the American bishops, asked by Rome to table action on the sex abuse crisis until a global meeting in February. What do you say to people whose pain can't wait until February? What I can say is we, uh, we sense a certain amount of pain ourselves. We are uh, working with you on your behalf. Outside the conference, outrage from survivors. I am stunned and, and disappointed. Accusing the Vatican of sending the wrong message. This message should have been, that's it. I want your resignations. A watchdog group demanding the bishops release the names of all abusive priests. We don't need the Vatican's permission for that to occur. An idea with support from some bishops. My own view is that, yeah, we should move toward complete transparency. I think that's what's called for at this time. And that means a different response from bishops, says survivor Luis Torres Jr. You were not called to be princes. Be the priests that you were called to be. To rebuild a damaged faith. Ann Thompson, NBC News, Baltimore. Hey, NBC News fans, thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking on that button down here and click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives. Thanks for watching.